This is the solution of exam 9709, paper 12 of March 2016, question 10. Here they are saying that there is a diagram here and uh, the curve 1 over 16, 3x minus 1 squared is drawn on it. Okay, it touches uh, x axis at P, they have shown here P. The point 3, 4 lies on the curve, which is here. And the tangent to the curve uh, crosses the x-axis at R. State the x-coordinates of P. P, right? So in other words, they are asking us to find the x-intercept of uh, the curve. For any uh, x-intercept, we should always substitute y equal to 0 because on x-axis, y-coordinate is always 0. So that's what we will do. We'll substitute this y in the curve equation equal to zero. Let me write the equation of the curve. So it will be zero equal to one over 16, three x minus one square. 16 goes and multiplies with zero by cross multiplication, zero equal to three x minus one square we can square root both sides so that this square is taken care of so 0 equal to 3x minus 1 let's move this minus 1 to the left side which is 1 equal to 3x and uh, according to this x will be 1 over 3 so the x coordinate of p this point is 1 over 3 let's talk about the second part showing all necessary working find by calculation x coordinate of r. So this is r and it has nothing to do with the curve except for the fact that it is on the tangent which is touching the curve at 3, 4. So basically just like this we will substitute y equal to 0 in the equation of the tangent and for that we have to find the equation of the tangent first. So equation of a tangent which is a line is y minus y1 equal to m x minus x1 where x1 and y1 are the coordinates of any one point on the line and 3, 4 is the point which is lying on the tangent so we can substitute this in the equation so y is 4 x is 3 and we don't change this x and this y now only challenge is to find m and for m we'll do something else somewhere else so m is the gradient of the tangent which is the differentiation of the curve at that particular point where this tangent is touching the curve so we will differentiate the equation of the curve which was this yeah so 1 over 16 is a constant it remains 1 over 16 we will not touch it at all now this becomes problem for us and we will apply chain rule, we can apply directly. Whenever there is a power of a function, we first differentiate what is inside the bracket, 3x minus 1, differentiate this one. Differentiation of 3x minus 1 is just 3. The second step is this 2 will come in front of the bracket and the bracket remains what it is, but it's exponent goes down by 1. So 2 minus 1 will be 1. So this is our gradient, general gradient of any point on the curve, but we want gradient at x equal to 3 because in our main picture we can see that x is equal to 3 at point q. So that's why we selected x equal to 3. So let's substitute 3. So 1 over, let's write multiply this, 3 times 2 is 6, so 6 over 16, 3 times x equal to 3 now, minus 1, and there's no need to power, write power 1. So 9 minus 1 is 8, so 6 times 8 over 16, that's the gradient. So 8 and 16 can cancel, 2 and 6 also cancel, so we get m equal to perfect 3. So we'll go back to our equation for the tangent and just write it 3 here. Now we want 
the x coordinate of r so just like we did for the curve we'll put y equal to 0 at x axis right so 0 minus 4 equal to 3x minus 9 if I open the bracket so minus 4 plus 9 this 9 minus 9 I brought to the left side equal to 3x that becomes 5 equal to 3x and the x coordinate of point R is 5 over 3 second part is also answered the area of the shaded region now this is what we need to uh, find out so what can we do uh, we can see the curve from P till here we can find the area under this curve which is between x axis and the curve this whole area we can find out right and from this area we can remove the triangle which is white if I see look this triangle is white we can remove the area of the triangle from the area under this curve and we'll get the shaded area so first we have to find the area of the triangle let's find it here only so since it is a straight line down and here the x coordinate of r we just found out 5 over 3 and the x coordinate of this point is 3 because it's here 3 so this becomes the base 3 minus 5 over 3 will give us the base so base of the triangle is 3 minus 5 over 3 which is 9 minus 5 4 over 3 height of the triangle will be the y coordinate of q which is 4 so height is 4 and now we can find the area of the triangle half base times height so 2 cancels here so it will become 4 times 2 8 over 3 that is the area of the triangle which we have to remove from the area under this curve and let's find the area under curve now so for that to find the area under the curve we have to integrate integrate the main function which is 1 over 16 I'm keeping out because it's a constant 3x minus 1 square dx and our limits are from p and uh, x coordinate of p was 1 over 3 right this is what we got till 3 yeah so 1 over 3 till 3 this will give us the area under curve and let's do it 1 over 16 untouched and we will uh, integrate this one since it's a linear function so we can do it directly 3x minus 1 over 3 over 3 divided by 3 divided by the differentiation of what is in the bracket this is how we do the integration of a power of function and that's how it will be plus c and from 1 over 3 to 3 let's substitute and this now this 1 over 3 and 3 will get it 1 over 16 now let's substitute 3 first 3 times 3 is 9 9 minus 1 is 8 8 cube over 9 plus C minus 1 over 3 will be put here so 1 over 3 times 3 will be 1 1 minus 1 will be 0 okay whole thing is 0 So C and C cancel out. So this is the only one left here. So it will be 1 over 16 multiplied by 8 cube is 512 over 9. And we can cancel 16 and 512. Easy. 32. Sorry. 32. So the answer is 32 over 9 unit squares. We already had an area of triangle which is 8 over 3 here. We'll subtract this from the area we got. So the area of the shaded part will be the area of uh, under curve 
minus area of the triangle. Area under curve, we just found out 32 over 9 minus 8 over 3 was the area of the triangle. It will be, if I multiply this by 3, multiply this by 3. 32 minus 24 is 8 over 9 unit square.